Welcome back. You're still watching SABC News Prime. Now, the housing strike crisis that we're seeing in parts of Gauteng has escalated to a national level. The Human Settlements Minister is engaging the Cooperative Governance Minister, the Gauteng Human Settlements MEC and the Johannesburg and Chwane mayors. Violence erupted for a third consecutive day over housing in Ennerdale, south of Johannesburg. <laughs> For days, these scenes in several townships in Johannesburg South. Now an attempt to douse the fires of discontent. Compounded by a criminal element, community leaders in Ennerdale have distanced themselves from the latest violence and arson threats. I don't understand what is a strike about today. I feel that it is completely criminal incited because why will we as protesters be throwing our own residents' cars, smashing people's cars and properties and looting shops. We got a notification about 3 a.m. this morning stating that there were elements, we don't know who they were, that were planning to burn down the primary school. This is the, this is the best primary school in Ennerdale. It is the only school, primary school in Mid-Ennerdale. The violent protest action over housing is high on the agenda. Most of us have not been able to engage with those community leaders. They've been meeting our officials. Uh, I will meet tomorrow two steering committees, the Anna Dale and uh, Eldorado uh, Park. But the minister has agreed that on Sunday we will all go with, with uh, uh, myself and the executive mayor and our teams and we'll meet with the steering committees of all the affected areas so that she's also able to hear them firsthand. Well, all hope is now pinned on a meeting between the Gauteng Human Settlements MEC, Paul Mashatile, and the community. Well, residents say only concrete solutions will put an end to the violence here and the other affected areas. The Gauteng housing backlog stands at 600,000. Chris Alder Lewis, SABC News in Johannesburg.